I'm so sorry. I wasn't sure if I pressed on mute, so I was just going to do it again. Hello, today is February 1st, 2023. My name is Tiffany Terry. I'm the staff here at RIT, the assistant director of the TRIO Upward Bound Program, and I'm looking forward to enjoying sharing my um, story about how I felt about Black Heritage Month here at RIT. So the first question is, why was it important for you to participate in the event today? Well, it's the start of Black Heritage Month, and I am African American, and I love to celebrate who I am. I'm very proud of who I am, and it just feels good to come along with everybody and learn great things about everyone and share history and um, be a part of history and just show um, community and togetherness with everyone who was involved. Um, question number two, how do you observe Black Heritage Month? Describe how Black Heritage Month is observed in your classes, peer groups, or within the RIT community. Um, when it comes to my classes, it feels good to be able to talk to students about celebrating who they are, building up their confidence in who they are, and ensuring that they're spreading that love and um, community building and history of who they stand to be and where they're going forward in life um, with them and with each other. Um, amongst my peer groups, we celebrate. Um, we gather together, we dress up together, we go to festivities, um, we share our heritage together. And it's always great when we have individuals from various cultures and religions who come in and support you as well. well not support you, but are part of this journey as well. Excuse me. When it comes to the RIT community, community, um, this will be my first time participating in the Black Heritage Month, so I just look forward to everything you have to offer and have plan to participate in as much as I can, excuse me. Um, C, how well, in your opinion, does RIT represent or amplify Black voices? Are there any changes that you'd like to see implemented? So again, um, how well, in your opinion, does RIT represent or amplify Black voices? Are there any changes that you'd like to see implemented um, at this time? Um, as again, a Rochester native, I have participated in a number of MLK speaking events, and so I have appreciated and really enjoyed and learned a lot about individuals, my history, my community, and us moving forward when it comes to our Black voices. So it's very empowering and uplifting, and it, it makes you, it allows you to self-reflect, and I really appreciate that. Are there any changes that you'd like to see implemented as of now? I see great things, and I would, of course, love to be a part of implementing some new things as time goes on. So at this time, I don't see a need for any changes. And the last question is, have you ever felt pressure to change your natural hair or conform to white Eurocentric beauty standards while working or studying at RIT? Um, tell us your experiences. Again, fairly new to RIT, but at the same time, it's a little yes and no um, for professional reasons. Of course, you want to look professional and clean and represent yourself in the most professional manner. So there are elements of um, a representation that I would like to represent. Um, however, with the Crown Act as being um, implemented and just recently, it's a gateway and an opening for you to feel more comfortable wearing your natural hair and even in professional settings. So just as I'm wearing my hair pinned up, um, I'm comfortable doing that. Um, <clears throat> It feels good when um, diverse individuals give me compliments on my hair. They, they really like my hair. And so it builds your confidence and makes you feel good about who you are being unique and um, wearing your crown the way that you feel most comfortable with. So um, I love the representation that I get to um, put out into the community, out into society. And so um, I believe that as time goes on, it'll be interesting for myself to see how I implement more of my natural hair in my um in the RIT community or just in my professional career. So thank you so much for having me participate in this. I think this is really great and I look forward to seeing how it turns out. Thank you.